Hi, did you know about the 2023 APC update for all the exams? You don't know? Or some people would have already known but don't know what it is actually. You're very much confused? Don't worry, I got you covered. This is Surya Johnson, your medical coding guide. Hi, this video is all about the 2023 update in the AAPC website for all the certification exams. As I told, some people would have already known what is that update is. Some of you have already booked the exam or some of you are about to book the exam and this update came. So the update is all the exam is going to be online exam. Yes, that is the update. To be frank, it's a major update because last two years because of this COVID, APC has introduced an online exam as well, like people who can go and do a proctor like live exam is available last, uh, till last year. Along with that, because of the COVID, they introduce this online exam, like people who are not able to go and write. And because of the restrictions in many countries, they are not able to go to a physical location and, and write that exam, right? In that case, they introduced this one, online exam. So, online exam was introduced like last two years. People used to take that online exam as well. I have already discussed in detail about my previous video about the CPC and overview. I will put the link in the description box below. Even that will be valid for some of you because it has so much value apart from this physical location exam. This video I am going to cover all about this 2023 APC new update about that online exam. So this exam from 2023 either it's CPC, CPMA or whatever it is, everything is changed to online only. So no more paper. Until previous year, the online is from your home or wherever you are comfortable to write, right? But from this year, this online exam will also be in a center. That is the big change. So in the, either way, you will be going in person and write that exam, not literally write that exam. It's everything electronic. That is what they meant. That is a major change. Everything is going to be electronic. No need of pencils, sharpeners, erasers and OMR sheets, confusions and everything. Yes, there are so many positive things in this also. I am going to explain to you. So, don't be scared. Don't be worried like how I am going to take this exam. Don't worry. I got you covered. So, in this video, I am going to, we are going to explore everything about that online exam in 2023. So, in this video, we are going to see what is the new update. I already leaked actually in the beginning of the video itself. It is going to be online. Second point we are going to see about what is the benefit of this new thing like everything becoming an online exam. Third one, how to apply for this online exam. Fourth, how to appear for this online exam. Fifth, approved code books. Sixth, we will see about the exam pattern, breakdown and passing score. These things I have already covered in the previous video about that CPC and overview. You can go and check also. And in this video also, I clearly elaborating everything according to this new update. The last one which is seventh one, the 2022 purchased exam voucher. The seventh one is for those who have already purchased an exam voucher or for those who have already finished their first attempt and, and unfortunately failed and you are planning to do your second attempt in 2023 or some people would have already purchased in 2022 for exam in 2023. Those all people will be much confused, right? I am going to clarify all your doubts. So, we will see the first point. What is new? So, the new is, as I already told, everything is going to be online only. That is the new thing. No more paper will be used. So, no more marking, no more paper question booklet. But the books you will be using is paper. That is obviously you will have the books will be paper format only. That is not changed. But the question booklet will not be paper. Your answer sheet will not be OMR sheet. It will all be electronic only completely into the computer system. So how does that work? I will cover in my next point. So before going into how to apply in everything, you know you are anxious like I am. I know that suddenly you have a pattern, you have already studied for something, you think that you are going to appear live and write everything and all of a sudden even if it is beneficial, even if it is uh, something upgrade, you will have that anxiety, right? I can understand that totally. So first of all, to remove all those anxiety from all of us including me, let us dive and explore what are the benefits. So the first benefit here is no papers are wasted. Yeah, environmental friendly. 
yes, it's much needed these days. So it is no more papers will be wasted, it's all electronic into the system. The second benefit is you will not make that mistake in that OMR sheet. Like in my last previous video in the CPC overview, I very much stressed about that OMR sheet. Like there are high chances of you to miss marking the answers and questions in that sheet, right? So you can avoid that manual mistake because each question in this electronic is coming is going to be like each question wise it will appear before you. So it will be easy for you to choose the right answer directly. You don't have to check the answer and go to the OMR sheet and just mark. There might be, there are, chan there are people who have, who have failed in exam because of this incorrect marking in OMR sheet. So this is the second benefit. Third benefit is this online, this online exam has opened up more number of slot availability. Like people who have already tried for slots for the exams, you know the struggle. There are so many students studying for medical coding in these years because of the increased opportunity in this industry. Because of that, you know, people are not able to get the slot. There will be particular slots and particular number of slots in particular uh, location. Because of that, so many people were not able to write on time like what they expected like this month I should become a CPC certified coder but they are not able to become because of the slot missing. So this online exam has opened up these slots. How? Because as per the news, in India itself, they are opening up new 30 centers to avail this online exam. So there are, will be new 30 centers where so many people can write exam in a month. So the third benefit here is the flexibility. This exam is going to be available every day in a week except the Sundays because Sunday is a holiday. <laughs> yes, so Sunday is a hall. Sunday will be a holiday. It will be every day in a week and also the sources say it will be in the morning, there will be a morning session and there will be an evening session. Think about this, you have every day exam, morning and evening session in the before and all there is no like two sessions in the same day. It will be like only one session in the morning and or in the evening like that. So now you have two sessions either in the morning or in the evening and every day in the week plus 30 centers open especially in India people who are going to write in UAE there will be centers open in Ajman and in Abu Dhabi as well that will benefit now we don't have it in Abu Dhabi recently right they are opening it up so it will be flexible for you you don't have to wait for the slots and another benefit here is it is a time saving for the organizers as well they, because they can accommodate so many students in a week in more, both morning and evening and it will be benefited for them and for the students as well. So these are the benefits of this. Uh, yes, I believe I pointed out all the benefits at least to my knowledge. If there, if you found there are so many benefits in this online exam, you can always put it in the comment section below so all of us will know more about these benefits. So the next one is how to apply for this online exam. As usual, you have to log into AAPC website. You can book, book your voucher. It will not directly go and lead you to the location. Before and all, if you're going to appear for the exam, when you're, looking, when you're booking the slots, it will show the location, the time, and how many seats are available, right? From now, from this year, it will not show the location. It will not show the time, uh, how many hours. It will not show how many seats are available because this is like unlimited once the centers are started they will accommodate accordingly so you will be buying vouchers are you going to the APC website login choose what certification you're going to choose is it CPC or any other specialty certification or any other basic certifications choose that certification then it will lead you into the payment role so you can go there pay for it if you are new if you have don't have membership you should you will be adding your membership amount as well exam fees plus the membership fees you should pay and book your voucher. Then after that, you will receive emails regarding all those details, follow the instructions and then whenever there is slots open, you will be notified in book according to your feasibility. So that is how you can apply for this exam. Simple as that. Also in my last video about the CPC, in the CPC and overview, explain the differences between an online exam and physical proctored exam, right? So we'll see the difference again. In this case, the physical location proctored, I crossed it out because you will not write, you will not use the paper format. There will not be location, there will be centers moving forward. But you have to go to the center and write. There is no more from your own place. Till last year, 
the online proctored exams you can take it at your own place the reliable internet connection with all those things i explained in my previous video so moving forward you don't need any equipments at all because you will go to the centers they will provide your system and there will be a proctor in place so they uh, so they are saying approximately in one uh, center that 10 to 20 examinees can sit and appear for that exam online so this is going to be the systems will be provided there so you don't have to prepare any equipments at all so location take take at home in a private location will be cancelled out you go to the center so the exam format still remains the same it is a hundred multiple choice questions in my previous video about that online exam i told online exams will not be a straight four hour exam but moving forward in 2023 it will be a straight four hour exam you will not get two slots for online exam it is only one slot straight four hour exam so this electronic exam is going to be a straight four hour exam in the system so these are the changes in this online exam the first changes you don't require any equipment because you'll not do it at your own home or a private location you'll go to the center and, and attend that online exam so you, there is no need for an equipment second important point to be noted in this online exam update is it is going to be a one part exam complete four hours straight breaks also included in this four hours so if you're going to take a break they will not stop the system timer and because they have created this online exam from this year 2023 as it's going to be four hours the timer will start once you start the exam it will not stop for your breaks it will be ending exactly after four hours only so this is how you'll appear for your exam no need to bring any uh, pencil sharpeners erasers or whatever it is no need no need of all those things and you're not allowed to take electronic gadgets or electronic uh, devices mobile phones calculators for some exams that requires calculator it is not it is not required for cpc for sure for some other exams that requires a calculator it is allowed in india alone they will be providing the centers will be providing your code books this year for the online exam it continues they will provide the code books in india they will provide the current year code books in india for your exam so you don't have to take the books as well in india but in uae not provide your books you should either buy or rent the books this is how the process still is followed in uae they will not provide you books in india they will provide you the books so the passing score remains the same it is 70 percentage only people before you ask this question i'm going to answer that one the result will be immediately after finishing the exam <laughs> i pray so but it's not that the result exam will take around five to seven business working days as usual in future they're expecting the exam uh, results will be released within a couple of days or in maybe advanced future it might be on the same day as well it's electronic right it is possible but as of now it will take around five to seven business working days so i hope i cleared your question <laughs> one more important thing for that online exam is there is no two attempt together for one price for the basic price you all know that till last year for online exam there is no two attempt option like only one attempt for one fees you already know that one right so if you pay for the online exam there's only one attempt for the fees you paid if you pass you pass if you fail you have to again pay another amount that exact same basic amount for the second attempt that was the case till last year but for the last year case for the exam that you're going to do it manually the paper return exam for that you had two attempts for one paid fees you all remember that one i believe so in this online exam what they did they're confident if you feel like you can crack that exam in one go itself there's only one attempt fees which is 430 dollars you'll be paying that for one attempt only so if you pass it's good unfortunately if you fail you can you will not have the second attempt in the scenario you have to pay again the 430 dollars to again appear for that exam second option that they have given which is in the first itself you can book for two attempts with an extra additional of hundred dollars so if you're going to pay for one attempt it's 430 dollars if, if you're going to pay for two attempts it's going to be 530 dollars so if you feel like to be on the safer side to not waste the money again or if you're not much confident in your preparation you can opt for that two attempt which is 530 dollar in the beginning itself so in case but i hope you will not fail that first attempt but in case if you fail you can go for the second free attempt because of that exam purchase so people who are going to ask the next question if i pass on that first exam with that two attempt voucher 
they will refund me the hundred dollars no forget about it so the approved code books are as usual cpt icd and hipix level 2 code books current 2023 code books. next one cpc breakdown there is no change in the cpc breakdown like i have discussed this in previous cpc and overview video you can go and check those in details i will also put the slide here how will be the breakdown this breakdown is for the cpc exam only certified professional code exam only not for the other uh, examinations and also people who want to opt for the other examinations if you want to know about any details about that please put it in the comment section below prepare that as well according to the demand so the final one an important question is 2022 purchased exam voucher so there will be like examinees who have already booked for the physical proctored exam for that manual exam you already booked for the paper based exam you already booked right so people who have booked but didn't appear for the exam for example in the manual in the manual exam you when you book for one exam you'll get two attempt right this two attempt please don't cancel that booking don't cancel that booking in the apc website if you can go and check there will be options like when you go and schedule when you go to the schedule your certification exam option there will be three columns here first one is your purchase and exam voucher this is for the new purchase not for the already you have a voucher you cannot redeem in this section this is for the new purchase the second one you will have a redeem an electronic exam voucher so this redeem an electronic voucher is for the if you've already previously purchased an exam voucher and you need to schedule your second attempt or your first attempt or you need to schedule that at you need to schedule that first or second examination attempt this one you'll go choose that redeem your uh, redeem an electronic exam voucher that you already purchased for those who want to reschedule or cancel an exam you will be choosing the third option so these are the three options available so for those for the question one i have already booked an in-person manual exam i haven't appeared for even a single exam these two vouchers will be converted to two attempts in the online uh, online exam so it will be automatically converted you have to go and redeem an electronic exam voucher only so for people who have already completed one exam you went in person for that manual exam you completed and you failed unfortunately plan of taking that second attempt in this 2023 what you will do you will redeem that single voucher for an online exam i hope i was clear there don't cancel that please don't cancel that because if you cancel you lose the big opportunity of two attempts because from this year it is going to be two for two attempt you have to pay a different fee right so you'll miss the opportunity of two attempts or also there will be a cancellation fee applicable to that cancellation so don't cancel at all redeem that voucher and convert it into 2023 online exam so that is how you should do so it's believed that this center online center exam will be begin by the third week of this january in all over india and also in ajmer and abu dhabi by the third week of january all the centers will be busy hopefully this is all about this 2023 apc exam update regarding that online exam soon and the next important thing is how will be this exam right so i'll give you an outline how will be the exam there's going to be a four hour straight exam you will go with all the id proofs like you appear for the previous exams you'll take any any good id proofs you'll take the id proofs that is acceptable in that country like in india passport aadhar card uh, otis id all those things and in uae it will be your emirates id and for the uae examinees you'll take your books with you and that's all if you want to have any snacks water you can take that with you that's it once the once the id has been checked you will be allowed into the exam center and once you start in the system there will be an exam software and you'll be provided with the login password you'll enter the software with your login and password and then there will be your personal details already displayed filled and displayed you don't have to fill anything just cross check all your personal details in the previous uh, paper based exam you have to fill all your personal details right so in this electronic exam in this online electronic exam you don't have to fill everything it will be already filled just verify everything whether all the things the details are correct and then just agree once you agree there will be the start button once you click start your examination time starts there will be a timer in your in that software itself 
the timer will start from 4 hours and gradually the timer will go down till 0 seconds and by that 0 second by the last second if you finish you will click finish if you forget to click finish by that last second it will automatically finish your exam and your exam will be submitted to wrap everything get out of the exam hall so that is the process here so once you start exam there is no way to stop that exam even that proctor there will be a proctor available so if you have any doubt in that system regarding that software you can very well ask them they will help you but they will not help you anything with your questions with your answers even they will not explain you the questions you know, manage your time wisely once the exam starts you can see one question at a time only you, you cannot see the entire hundred question in a stretch for back in those days the examiners what they do they just go around for the smallest questions or the sections which they want to go first right it's not available like that it will be one question at a time so you have to finish the question go to the next so people if you are asking me if i don't know this answer for this question what i have to do you can always flag it there, there will be a flag option you just flag it that flag means that you didn't answer the question or you have a doubt so whenever after flagging at the, at the end of the 100 question you can click the flag and all those questions one by one it will appear to you only those flag questions will appear to you one by one so you don't have to waste your time searching for the questions you thought you will come back to this 41st question so you don't have to like go back 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 there will be an option for back 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 as well but you don't have to use that one and waste your time you can if you click the flag all those flag questions only will start coming one by one that will also come one by one only so you can just go and finish off all those questions so this is the benefit of the flag so make use of the flag uh, don't waste your time in one question itself like i already discussed in my cpz how, how to take up the exam most effectively i've already explained it in my previous video i'll put it in the description box below so you can go and check those things still applies to this online exam as well so don't waste more than two minutes for a question Just go ahead if you are in doubt if you are if you don't know the answer flag it and move on to the next question that's it and the next question here is in the question in your system you can also highlight previous CPC series video I shared about the inside the exam hall tips right there I have told you like in the question booklet you can mark the important keywords so after some time if you want to come back to that question those keywords alone you can just check and you can conclude the answer that's what I told you right you can also highlight likewise in this online exam question with a right click on your mouse you can highlight the keywords then and there wherever you, you think you feel like these are the keywords for your answer you can highlight them and it will be saved you don't have to again read from the top to bottom again you don't have to waste your time so there is an highlight option in the system as well so in the beginning itself if you uh, have a doubt just call the proctor to guide you for that at least for the highlighting so they'll just teach you so this is all about the 2023 AAPC update about this exam once these things are released I came up quickly with all those things maybe I have repeated the same points over and over in some areas but I want to stress because this very short time I just wanted to deliver this uh, news to you as fast as possible but I believe that you got my point if you have any doubts, questions, queries, you can very well put it in the comment section below. I am very much happy to answer all your queries. If you found this video to be useful, please hit the like button and share with all the friends that will be benefited by this video. And if you are new to this channel and found this video to be interesting, I have a much more interesting video in my YouTube channel. You can always go and check it out. Subscribe and hit the notification icon so you will not miss any of my future videos. This is Surya Johnson, your medical coding guide.